Hi, my name is Ian. I am an academic tutor at MAGIC. MAGIC stands for Miami Animation Gaming International Complex at Miami-Dade. If you are interested in learning more information about MAGIC, please check the description box below. I will be making a series of t tutorial videos for MAGIC. Alright, let's get started. Okay, start by clicking on the latest version of Unity. If you want to make a new project, you click here. If you want to add a previous project, you click here. The tutorial is how to navigate through Unity, the layout, how to save a project, and how to save the, pro the scene project. So all right here is the Unity editor and it's made up of four parts. The scene, the hierarchy, the inspector, and the project window. And if you like to like change the, the way the layout is, you can just go to uh, the side over here and you can switch out the layouts. You make it wider, taller, or you can split it into four parts. Or you can put it back to the default position. And that's most of what we're going to work with today. Okay. Alright. Uh, and these are the, the two bars. Um, so here's one. This one is the for the play. So it renders the scene from the camera, the main camera of your level and you can pause it and you can step step by like st st step it like frame by frame All right, let's bring in a, one, another object uh, let's make it a uh, key a cube. Alright, so each tool do, does something. You can use the hand to like move around in the scene. And you can use the move tool to like move the cube. You can rotate the cube. And you scale the tool. Cube. Uh, this one is it's like like mostly for um two D. And, and, and um, you what you mostly use it for the UI, but I think you can still manipulate the the uh, the score the cube. And the next one, what it does, it it does it all at one time, so you can move it and move it if you want. And you can use the mouse, the middle mouse button scroller to to zoom in, to zoom out, and you can use you can press Alt to to get an eye's point of view of your object. And you can use this and scale and use this um the middle mouse button to zoom in and zoom out. And if you like far away from your object and you want to get back close to it, you just can double click on the on your object just by double clicking on it. And also, I think if you press F, it does the same thing. All right. Let's see if I any, if I miss anything. Uh, like I said earlier, uh, 
is made up of four parts and you have tabs you can see you can have a you have a tab that's to the asset store uh, you can add more tabs by going to add and I'll just add it it'll just, it'll just let's, let's try one of these um, I think project uh, pretty much a duplicate of this one if you, if you don't want it you can just close the tab and then seeing things can move you can move it around however you like it but we'll keep it in the fitness position for now and you have the different tabs and you can like wherever you see this this shows that you can like add another tab all right so for you to save a project you just click on save uh, since you already made the project it's already saved and it's already made a folder for it so you when you're like you're doing a project like we like we have here just save it and, and it saves everything now we are saved we saved the whole project but we didn't save the scene of the project so this is all right here right now it's a scene so you have to go to file save as and you give the scene a name all right magic level one you save it and it makes this scene right here so and this is like your scene saved right here with just this like saved right here and you can like uh, make another one just go to save as but you can overwrite your original scene or you can make a new one or make another one If you double click on it it'll send you to that scene but since they're both the same it's hard to tell which is what but like if you made any change in here let's delete the cube all right when we double okay so this will like indicate you which level is what of the title of the, t of the level so if you delete the cube and you save it so this level one doesn't have the cube but level two did the, the, the cube is there and that is it for today's tutorial if you enjoy content like this and would like more don't forget to like and subscribe also, if you want more information about Magic or want to see more content from Magic social media, check the description box below. See you in the next tutorial.